What is that? My name is super interesting those times. And with me on this presentation is Buddha as a company. Having the boss was growing back up. The group was not very just Oh, it grew up in Tobacco. Okay. Uh, he lived in Tobacco for the past five years or so, or two years, or recently. I remember what I woke up in the morning and then just coming outside, you see a dark cloud hovering around the environment. You woke up in the morning and then you see a dark cloud hovering something black and then you just notice something. Something about that. You see the environment coming so dark. Something you've not seen before. Who has seen it? Who has seen it before? Yes, also, yes. When you also clean your nostril, you also notice that you find the black. So what are you saying? Or oh, you even in your floor, in your houses, you you after arranging your house in the morning, you went you went for work or for your classes, and you came back, you saw that there are certain black spots on the floor, or even in the shape of the house. And then you can use the perfect example. Just you can you can touch this now. I'm seeing something here. This is black. Yes, we are not we are not, not it's not possible that we find it in our desk because this morning before we came, it was. Clean by uh, 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 our cleaners. That, that brings us to what we want to talk about today, this morning. Black suit in Otago. It's a problem. I remember uh, recently I was told that one of our colleagues while coming to school, he came with a white dress. As he, as he approached the class, somebody noticed that they saw, what is all these uh, black stains on your, on your clothes? The person said he had not he had not he had not seen it before. He told him this is black suit. He said the person told me I've, I've not seen this this kind of uh, this uh, spot before. So these things can mess us up. And it's a problem and it's affecting us. So that is why it is important that we talk about it in, in this in this very important that we talk about it. Now our objective, the objective of this presentation is to know what is black suit. What is this? What is this black suit? What is it, it or what are the causes of this black suit? What is the impact of this black suit? And how can we remedy, how can we profound solution to this, to this problem as it pertains to water quality? Now, introduction, what is black suit? What is this black suit? Now, black suits are impure particles of carbon. They are particles of carbon, which is a which is which got a long, which, which, is gotten from incombustible or incomplete combustion. Now, if you notice, you burnt your if you, if you when incomplete 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 combustion happens when there is not enough oxygen or air. When there is not enough oxygen or air, then the it becomes it becomes incomplete combustible. For example, look at your uh, when you burn when you try to burn your uh, you try to burn your wood. Because the air or the oxygen is not regulated, it produces some some some, uh, some some of these black things. You notice them. These are incombustible. These are incombustible. Uh, uh, these are incombustible gases. Now, what? When did it start? When did this start? Now, the issue of soot or black soot didn't just start from present. None of us just notice the effect is felt now. We just notice it now. It's an it has, It is something that has been on and on. And then, and then it was in Portaco. It was first noticed, or it came to the notice of the society in 2016. It, it came to the problem in 2016 because it became so rampant, it began to affect life. People were disturbed. Some persons who did not know what is happening, they were running better, better. And then government, people trying to uh, involve the government on black school and how they can bring this picture. So at this point, I will allow my other colleagues to go on and look at the cost of black suit. Thank you. OK, so we look at the causes, the primary causes of this suit in the atmosphere, one of which is the illegal oil refining, or what we locally know as the coal fire. This, please remember that suit is, is um, as a result of burning of fossil fuels, the uprising of this illegal refining has increased the level of suits we have in the atmosphere. We also have 
gas flaring, which is as a result of the oil and gas anticipation, the companies that will have in the state. Now, the penalty for flaring gases is not, it's not high, it's very, it's very low. So these companies just go ahead to flare gases and then later pay the, the, the penalty for it. We also have indiscriminate burning of tires. If you've been in Portacourt for a while, you notice that if there's any protest, you see people burning tires on the streets, on the road, or even cultural events, or any festival um, events. You see people burning tires. This also has been contributed to the level of increase in the soot in the atmosphere. Then we look at how this has impacted us as a people. Air pollution. If you look at this um, picture over here, you can see the clouds, these dark clouds covering over the city. That is a serious air pollution issue. It will lead, or lead us to the health issues. Also, if you notice, this cloud is preventing the sun from getting to us. And if you're not having adequate sun, you are exposed to cancer, you can have weak bones, growth of weak bones, you can have skin issues, skin problems. Also, you have respiratory issues, this is part of the health issues. If you look at this uh, picture here, this is the lung, the picture of the lung. This side here on the right breast, the right chest, you can see the healthy, how the healthy lung look like. But look at this one. Here and left. This is the lot that has been saturated with smoke. Yes, we say I don't smoke cigarettes, I don't smoke this, but we are inhaling these things on a daily basis. We don't know this, like you showed you a sample of it. You are inhaling it and it's going to your lungs. You don't really know how it's impacting it. So that is what, um, some of the health issues that this suit can cause to us. And then we have economic impact. If you've noticed, if you're outside, you notice that people have been leaving for tackles. Businesses have been leaving because the environment is no longer suitable for people. People that want to, want to leave to Lagos, to Abuja, because of this suit in Port Harcourt. That will affect the economy of the state of the state of Port Harcourt. And then the social impact. Also, there is no much outdoor activities anymore. People no longer have events, outdoor activities like we used to. Now it's mostly at event centers. And if you notice, to parents do not allow their children to come out to play for long hours. It's usually indoors, they stay indoors, try as much as possible to reduce their outside um, exposure because of that sort. That has affected us in a social manner. And then we have environmental problems. Now, like he mentioned, my colleague mentioned, they come out in the morning, you see this um, cloudy mist that usually it depends your vision, you're not seeing. Sometimes in the evening too, you see it. It's not that rain was before. That is the last we're talking about in the atmosphere. Because, and that is called the haze. That's the, the proper 